Am I wearing sheep earrings for my jewelry line? Bad, no. Bad, yes. Bad, inexpensive. Bad, limited edition. Bad, bad. Baby, bad, 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 bad. <laughs> Hey guys, haul time, no see. I'm sorry. It's one of those days today. It's one of those Red Bull days today. <laughs> I got some new decor in the background. This says shine bright, it's out of focus, but it does in fact say shine bright. And I couldn't get off the sticker, so you see the number two there, but you won't know the full price, so you'll just have to guess. $200, $2, $24.99. It was $24.99. I will get the sticker off in future videos, so if that's not a reason to subscribe, then I don't know what is. So I'm going to be doing a back to school series. I'm not sure if this is going to be the first back to school video I'm posting, but anyways, I'm going to be doing a big back to school giveaway, so stay tuned for that and stay tuned for more back to school videos. Let me know in the comments down below what kind of back to school videos you guys want to see. Okay, so this is going to be a very, very, very large makeup haul already out of breath. It's two minutes, 12 seconds. Perfect. I have so much stuff, guys. This is going to be a long video. Heads up. But I think it's kind of nice to have a combination of like short videos, long videos, medium videos, and stuff like that. So this is going to be the long video. Okay, might as well just hop right in and I recently picked up the L'Oreal True Match Lumi Healthy Luminous Makeup. I only tried this one time and I do have to say it does not have the fullest amount of coverage but because I've only tried it at one time I feel like I can't really say that much about it except for the coverage. I picked it up because my L'Oreal Infallible Foundation ran out and I absolutely love it so much and it wasn't on sale. It's $20.99 here in Canada and the frugal side of me is just like no, won't do it, no. I will go for the foundation that is on sale for $17.99 that I haven't tried out even though I need a new foundation stat. But I mean that's just my life. Next just some random things. I have the Smashbox photo finish. Um, I think that this was at my aunt's house and she's not really into makeup so I questioned her about it and she was like, Savannah my dear you can have that and I was like okay and K my dear I will have that thank you so much. I haven't tried it out yet, I've heard amazing things about it, this is just the trial size. Next, a kind of random thing, and I think I got this from buying the Laura Mercier foundation like eons ago, just haven't hauled it in a video, and I haven't tried it out yet. But this is the translucent loose setting powder. Okay, not really makeup, but I really want to show you guys this. It is a Hollister perfume. Okay, I'm super, super, super picky when it comes to perfume, but I absolutely love this. I'm pretty sure that this is the original, perhaps I just rebranded it. But the name of this is Malaya, M-A-L-A-I-A. I'd say that this perfume isn't really intense. I guess maybe I like fresh scents with a little bit of floral, I don't even know. I used to wear the Jacob perfume, but I got discontinued because they went out of business. I would have bought more button-down shirts from them if I knew it would save my perfume. Education is power, my friends. Okay, and so now some stuff that I got sent from this company called Perfumity, and they have a lot of like limited edition stuff, and I'm pretty sure their makeup is cheaper than what the actual stores would have it as. Okay, so the first thing is this Marguerite, Majorite, Majorette, Cigarette blush by Benefit. And when you open it, it is this color, and it is a cream blush, and it's like a coral thing. Okay, I'm gonna be doing swatches in this video, because guess what I bought? Baby wipes. I bought baby wipes. I feel very makeup geek. Pretty. Oh wow, that looks like stunning on camera. Holy crap. Yes, yeah, so they're just kind of like a coral peachy orange color. Absolutely stunning. I think this retails for $36, but I think that they have it cheaper on Perfumity. Let me just get my baby wipe. I felt so funny. I was in um, Sobeys today, like getting my baby wipes, and I just bought baby wipes in Red Bull and I don't know what the cashier would have thought about that. Next, they sent me this brush by Clay de Poe, and correct me if I'm wrong, but I think that that's like an insanely expensive brand or something like that. But it is just a foundation brush. I'm more of a fan of like the denser ones where I can just like pack on that liquid, cover up the redness, you know what I'm saying? This is just kind of like, let the redness show, you know, let them know you're red. They sent me this perfume that I'm not like a huge fan of, but it is the Aromatics in White. I have no idea what brand this is. But it is just a perfume roller ball. To me, this kind of smells like an older scent. 
and it's just like it's just so intense it is so intense I do not like intense perfume scents so I will definitely pass this on to a friend okay so they sent me three mini palettes which is absolutely insane and I want you guys to know that I feel so insanely blessed it doesn't even make any sense I just feel so insanely lucky when I get these packages. I think it's absolutely insane. This is going to be my last makeup haul before my decluttering series, by the way. So I am going to be, like, getting rid of a lot of my makeup and giving it to friends and stuff like that. Okay, so the first palette is by Bobbi Brown, and this is what it looks like. So when I first opened the palette, I was insanely impressed by it. I was so excited to use it. Um, something in my eye. I can't see. I can't see. It's not being dramatic. You can see, man. You can see. Okay, so when I first opened up this palette, I was like, holy, oh my goodness, this thing is beautiful. And it is beautiful, but I have to say, not insanely impressed with the quality of the eyeshadows. I will swatch them here. Look at that. Maybe you guys can't see from far away, but they are like super chalky. But this is, I think it's limited edition, it's called the Crystal Eye Palette. Next palette I'm super excited about because I actually have no MAC eyeshadows. Ask me how many MAC eyeshadows I have. Zero zero now I have four and this is in the quad melt my heart this is such a beautiful smoky eye palette look at those shadows guys they are so insanely pigmented boop 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 I do have to say I'm very 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 impressed with them and I can't wait to go clubbing so I can wear those who wants to go clubbing with me? I would love to do like a get ready with me video clubbing I'm talking like I go clubbing all the time I don't and by clubbing I just mean like dancing in a corner by myself. Okay, and the last palette is by Estee Lauder. Am I saying that right? And this quad is called Pure Color Batik Sun. Okay, and I'd say the packaging is very beautiful. It's like this gold cool color, but the colors I would say are actually quite unique and I'm super, super, super excited to wear them more. It has that gorgeous kind of aqua color and it has an orange color and it has a purple color. So those are the swatches. Very impressed with these eyeshadows. Yep. Yep, very, very, very nice. I think it has some unique colors. I think this is a limited edition, but you should be able to get it on Perfumity. Okay, so thank you so much, Perfumity. Um, I feel very, very, very lucky and grateful for those products. Thank you guys so, 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 so much. Guys, I don't even know if that's the half of it. Like I said, this is a huge video. So now I'm going to be showing you guys the stuff that I got from It Cosmetics. And if you guys didn't see my How to Cover Up Acne video, it was my entrance for the It Girl Cosmetics contest. And unfortunately, I did not win, but that is totally, totally, totally okay. I said in my video, it's so important to put yourself out there. It's inevitable that you're going to have failures, setbacks, not going to win a contest. Obviously, there's so many awesome people who are entering. It's totally okay, but you never know unless you try. So important to at least try. And I just want to say, like, thank you guys so much for your feedback because I got so many thumbs up on that video in relation to how many views it had. I think I have like over a thousand thumbs up and that's like a lot for me. Um, a lot of you guys thumbs up the video and that's insane. Like thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for voting for me or at least like helping me trying to get into the top 20 even though I didn't make it. Um, thank you guys so much. So anyways, they sent I think 250 of like the pre-entrance $250 of their products. I don't know. I haven't tried out it cosmetics prior to that and I was just so insanely in shock and impressed with the package It's crazy. So it came in this box. It's kind of like all you know muffled up now because I've opened it like 10 hundred times but it came with like the pretty bow and stuff like that. So the first thing is the It Cosmetics Brow Powder Universal Eyebrow Pencil. So I don't know if you guys can tell or not, but my eyebrows are different and it's because I'm using this. So it has a spoolie on one end and then it has a wax tip on the other. And they just kind of sent out this color to maybe everyone. I don't know if they catered it or anything like that, but I find that this definitely does match me and I feel very lucky because this is like the only high-end eyebrow product I have. And this is in the shade Universal Taupe. Next is something that is crazy exciting. The packaging reminds me of NARS and it's the Live Love Laugh. <laughs> I just snorted. I said it right though and I was like, you didn't say it right. Live Love Laugh Vitality Face Disc with Drops of Light Technology. I mean, that sounds awesome. I have a hard time opening it, but I don't know if that's just me and my incapabilities. <sighs> okay. So it comes with a bronzer, a blush, and a highlight. My shepherd's pie in the oven is done. Okay, and here are the swatches. 
This video, man, is gonna be way too long. Okay, those are the swatches. Aren't they really, really, really pretty? I absolutely love this product. So happy about that. Be right back. Next is the It Cosmetics Naturally Pretty Palette, and I've seen this all over YouTube, so I was extremely elated to get this. These are all matte eyeshadows besides the Transforming Pearl shade. And there are some swatches on my arm. Next is the Clinically Proven to Increase Lash Volume by 430% Mascara. That can't be the correct name. It is the Hello Lashes Mascara. And I thought that this was a really interesting shape, I guess, for a mascara. I'm not going to open it because I don't want the time ticker to start. You know what I mean? <sighs> okay, guys, this brush is insane. I haven't used it yet, but it is gorgeous. Oh, my God. Hands down, probably the nicest brush I own now in my collection. And it is the Heavenly Luxe Wand Ball Powder number 8. But I thought that it would be great to put on blush or just all over powder or something like that, but it is so insanely soft. It's beautiful. This is probably my favorite product that I got from It Cosmetics, and it is the Vitality Lip Flush in Je ne sais quoi. So it looks just like a lip balm. It smells really, really, really nice. It smells like cherries, but you put it on, and I think that it kind of like magically transforms to your perfect shade. And on me, it's like... A really nice kind of mid-toned pink and I'm pretty sure it does plump up your lips as well I do kind of feel like it tingles and my lips do look plumper absolutely love this it's gorgeous then for the next brush it is the no tug dual eyeshadow so this would be like a good lid brush and this is like a good kind of smudge brush then I got the Tightline Full Lash Length 3-in-1 Eyeliner, Primer, and Mascara. I haven't opened up this one either. I think that it's supposed to just like really kind of get into your eyelashes to make it look like you're wearing eyeliner when you're really not. And then I have the No Tug Waterproof Gel Eyeliner. And this is just a small black gel eyeliner. Are you kidding me? Look at that. What? That's magic. Wow, this is probably the longest video I will have up on my channel to date, but I just kind of wanted to do a big, gigantic back to school makeup haul. These are the items that I will be wearing for the next coming months for back to school time for the fall. And don't forget to leave me some requests down below for back to school videos, and if you want to stay tuned for upcoming videos as well as the giveaway, make sure to subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!